Oh, look, Grandpa. That's either Central Park or else some rich guy's got a huge backyard, right? Heathcliff! Grandma, what's that big building sticking way out into the park? Oh, that's uh, the home of my old girlfriend back when I lived here in New York City. You never lived in New York, and I'm your old girlfriend. Iggy, that large building is where we're going, the museum. I don't understand why they leash pets. Humans cause much more damage. Then again, they do pay for the pet food. Dangerous work. Ooh, it reminds me of wash day. Watch out for the alligators down there. Alligators? What do you mean, Grandpa? Iggy, Below us, there are miles and miles of dark, lonely places for alligators to roam. Excuse me, buffalo roam. Ooh, alligators slither. But not in the New York City sewer system. That's only a myth. Notice how these workers stay in punches? They're afraid. They even leave in a group. Someday, someone, a new hero, will be brave enough to bring one up. That someone will be remembered forever as the one who made New Yorkers face the truth. Danger lurks just a flush away. Green light. We accept our furs that are dead, uh, not alive. So, unless you're willing to skin your cat. Listen here, honey pie. Grandpa! Will you do it for five dollars? It'll behave, right? I'll behave like a tornado. Ten bucks. There isn't a shopping bag in the world that can hold me. I'll break out of here. And I'm gonna catch me an alligator, too. Myth or no myth, then I'll get the respect I deserve. Don't try it, animal. Might as well check out my temporary quarters. They carpet this place. Yeah, no problem. I'll just climb up the ladder and slide the cover off. <laughs> Let me out of here! Uh, I'll just find another one. Help! <laughs> you know, anyone can come to New York City and go to a museum. But how many tourists make the effort to see the real New York? <laughs> Time to move on. <laughs> oh, we uh, don't need to go that way. <laughs> hey, I'm flexible. A menace. Someday, someone will be brave enough to bring one up. Someone will be brave enough. A new hero. I can bag an alligator. 
The question is, do I want to bag an alligator? Oh, that's never been one of my goals. But I am Heathcliff, and I am going to get one. What's an alligator? A dog with short legs? Now, where is that wimpy creature? No need for a compass. Here we go. Freeze, lizard face. Hold it right. Uh, no offense, uh, Mr. Gator, sir. And now that he's off guard. Hey! All right. I give up. Eat, eat me peacefully. Just swallow and skip the chewing. <laughs> sure you was, but you went the distance. Yo, Edwin, I love you. <laughs> Just what I need. Some place to rest. Heathcliff. Uh, what's yours? Uh, what's the matter? Uh, cat got your tongue? <laughs> I like your enthusiasm, uh, but I didn't mean that close. I've got to think of something. Nice move. Shh. Capture an alligator, and I'm gonna capture an alligator. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, oh. <laughs> Whoa! I'm glad that's over. When I first saw you, I knew it was love. Your claws are more beautiful than a, uh, uh, glove. No, 
What rhymes with love? Dove rhymes with love. Right. Your claws are more beautiful than a dove's. Your face shone so bright in the rays of the sun. I knew forever we would have. Ah, writing a love song for Cleo? Ain't that sweet, guys? Huh? He's in love. That's nice. <laughs> I'm too cool to tell Cleo I love her. She knows that. In fact, when we first met, she got to see how cool I really am. What a day that was. Oh, no. Here we go. We met in the scratching post, one of the toughest hangouts around. This place was so tough, garbage men were afraid to pick up the trash. But that didn't bother me. I knew what to expect. Uh. Uh, here, Mr. Riffraff, uh, would you like my chair? Huh? Yes, sir, Mr. Riffraff. Uh, what, what can I get you, sir? Uh, milk. Yes, sir. Right away, sir. Wow! That's when I first saw her. Hey, baby, the time is right for you and me tonight. Who, me? You like me? You'll have to ask my date. This is Goon and his two brothers. Is there something you boys want? As a matter of fact, there is. Uh, your autograph? Naturally, I refused and took Cleo out of there before I had to cause any more trouble. Yeah. Cleo knew I was the coolest cat around. That's the craziest thing I ever heard. Cleo! Ah! Oh. Yeah, Jay, Cleo, we were just talking about how cool Riff Raff is. I heard. Riff Raff told you one side of the story, the wrong side. We met at the scratching post, all right. I was out with Goon that night. Hey, Cleo, baby. You're here with the strongest cat in the world. Makes you feel pretty good, huh? Tremendous. Yeah? Hey, watch where you're walking. Ah! Oh. Hi, guys. Who's winning? Excuse me, I'm leaving now. Water. Water! <laughs> I can't find my brush. I'll help you, babe. Huh? Here it is. Ah! Oh. Who did that? Uh, 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 ah! Come on, Goon, put him down. Wow. Sure thing, baby. Guys, how about a little softball? What's the matter? Goon and his brothers are out cold. We'd better go now. 
I really showed them, huh? Knock their lights right out. Riff Raff never threw a punch. Once the truth comes out, we see it wasn't much of a bout. If you guys saw the size of this monster, you'd turn kitty too. As a matter of fact, you'll see Goon today. Today? I came to tell you, Goon and his brothers are heading into town on the 12 o'clock train. That means I've only got one hour to catch the 11.55 train out of town. Hey, everyone, look at our brave leader turn Frady Cat. I'm not a Frady Cat, I'm a smart cat. Smart enough to leave before I lose my whiskers. Yeah, a uh, riff raff. Are you gonna leave, Cleo? You're right. I'll stay. I knew he would. Riff Raff's really brave underneath. <laughs> Yeah, he's not gonna have much of a chance fighting this guy if he's sleeping. This'll wake him up. What's the big idea? What time is it? Time to shape up or get beat up. Let me go! Let me go! These guys are wimps, weaklings, nerds. You know the kind. All talk and no action. Okay, let's find Riff Raff. Friends just showed up, and I think they're looking for you. Unless you'd like Cleo to greet them. You're right. I'll show them. Uh-oh. If you got something to say, Riff Raff, say it to my face. Oh, uh, you see, uh, w what I had in mind uh, is that sometimes... Uh, come, come on, on say, say it. it. Come, come on, on, boss. Goon. This town isn't big enough for the two of us. You can leave any time. Hey, Riff Raff, how's my girl Cleo? That's funny. She, she was just talking about you. That's the only fight I ever lost. You and me got some unfinished business. So what are you doing here, Goon? Did you go to all this expense to come across the country just to beat me up? Actually, I didn't. I came to wish you all the best. I think you make a wonderful couple. I always felt bad about that time I roughed you up, and I want to apologize. You do? I have to catch a train home now, but could you give these to Cleo and tell her hello? Yeah, he wasn't such a bad guy. Riff Raff? Riff Raff, I'm proud of you. You used your brains, not your brawn. What little you have. But that's why I like you. Here's some flowers I bought. If you let your puppy chew an old shoe or slipper, he just might chew up your new shoes and slippers. A puppy can't tell the difference, so give him a bone or a piece of ride. That'll do the trick. <laughs> <laughs> 